Okay, for this particular video, I'm going to show you how to search Google Images that are free to use and free to share, which is what you have to use for this project. Um, and I'm also going to show you how to save pictures. Uh, those are two very important things. Always, you can go to the Weebly and the Google Advanced Search link is there, but you can also just search it here. Google Advanced Image Search, and you see it pop up there. And here it is in this first link. So I'm going to use this one here. It's the same thing as you search. Search what you want. Solar energy is what the one I'll search for here. And I want a picture of solar energy, but I have to come down here to the bottom. And where it says usage rights, I'm going to change free to use or share. All right, and then I'll do my advanced search that way. And these images now can be used however you see fit. They're free to share and use. So let's say, for example, I want this picture right here for um, my project. I need to save it. The, a lot of people save it right here. And... While it's not a bad way to do it, it's not the best way to do it. Let me go back here to my image. Um, so what you need to do here is click on View Image. And that gives you the full image. And now, if you want to, you can right-click and you click Save Image As. You can see here you have a couple options of where to save it. What you need to do is then click down on, it says My Initials, but it'll be your student number. Click on that, and then you can save it in a folder wherever you want. I would recommend that you click on... Um, maybe pictures or documents, whatever the case is. I'm going to save mine in the pictures here. And maybe you want to rename it. I'm going to rename it Solar Panels. If I could spell. And then I save it here. So everything is saved. So let me minimize stuff here. And I will open up the computer and click on my name, which remember is your number. And if I click on Administrative Pictures, there is solar panel and those are the pictures that you're going to use that are free to share and distribute and you can also upload these images into voice right at the end when you are done.